After taking a hit from Eddie's free bass pipe, you might be invited to partake in one of Eddie's favorite pastimes, Russian roulette. Although partaking usually meant you just watched Eddie do it to himself while all of you were out of your mind's high. That's kind of almost worse. Yeah. You can do a bunch of drugs and you just watch the guy who owns the house <laughs> and he's just being like, la 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 la. He's like skipping around the house and yeah. then click. <laughs> and then he does the, you should see your faces, man. You guys are all fucking freaked out. Eddie, however, would involve new guests in a game that they didn't even know they were playing. When a new girl, guy, or whoever was brought to Eddie's place, he'd sometimes make them go to a room and sit on a couch. Before them, strewn across a coffee table, were literal piles of and jewelry in addition to large wads of cash. In front of them was a large mirror. That mirror was, of course, two-way. And that was his way of assessing the guest. You know, but thankfully, like, there was no penalty if you took anything. You now were just we asked to leave. Yeah, yeah. Hey, buddy, that's rude.